Hey fashion lovers, welcome to the Fashion Try-On. If you want to support our channel, please be sure to like and subscribe. And if you like any of the items you see, be sure to check the description for links and discounts. Today we're unboxing and trying on the new Salmer BB in the Epi Leather Color Brown. Now this bag does come in a few other shades. It comes in a black, a kind of mustard yellow, and it comes in a ivory white, and they are all beautiful. I was very torn between each of them, but I ended up going with this brown cognac color because I thought it was the most unique. I also really liked the black Epi leather, but I do have the Alma BB in the black color, so I felt like this was the most different from that piece of my collection. That being said, if I didn't have the black Alma, I would definitely have gone with the black. Now we're getting our first looks of the bag and you can see that overall it is just a very manageable size. It's not too big, it's not too small, and that is really what you get with the BB size. Whenever I look at Louis Vuitton bags, I am usually on the smallest size. I'm not usually all the way to the micro, but I do really like the BB, the smallest of the Alma, the PM, and that kind of vibe. Now, looking inside the bag, it is a little strange. And I think it's because of this outside pleating. So you see you kind of have like two separate bags or two separate compartments and you see the little side buckle connecting them together. I do think that has an impact on the inside. So that's why you're seeing it's kind of warped in, which creates a kind of weird experience when you're actually using the bag. Now, having used it for about a month now, I can say that it doesn't bother me as much as I thought that it would be something I don't have to actively work around, but it is something that I noticed that you kind of have to place things a little bit more carefully. That being said, I love the overall design and I think it's totally worth it. Now, as you're seeing, this bag does come with a long shoulder strap as well as a shorter handle bag, which I absolutely also really love. So I have been wearing this with both of the straps connected. I've put the smaller strap kind of in the front, kind of flapping down, and then I'll carry it as a shoulder bag. So overall, I think it's, it just kind of adds another little style element, although you could remove one or the other if you wanted to. Now you will notice that the strap, the smaller strap, as well as the center piece right in the middle have the LV logo and the Louis Vuitton name written out. Um, those are just a gold etching. They're not embossed or anything um, noticeably different with the material. Now here you see it tried on and I don't usually wear this as a shoulder strap, but I will wear it kind of crossbody and then put my arm through the shoulder strap so it kind of looks like a dual effect. I've also heard that people have started doing this for extra safety and security of your purse when you're walking around a crowded city. That is all we have on the Salmer. Let me know in the comments below if you like this bag, if you have it, if you love it, if you hate it. If you've made it to the end of this video, be sure to leave a heart or your most recent emoji in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching and be sure to subscribe.